Marlon Martinez. St. Thomas Aquinas Raiders. 7A. Um, I'll be thinking about celebrating with the guys, making sure everybody's feeling good. We got a little chip on our shoulder because we have unfinished business to take care of. I mean, we're just going to show it through the way we play. We're taking it one week at a time. Marlon Martinez. Uh, obviously, this is a huge game. Uh, final uh, game in the state uh, playoff run for St. Thomas, which they got there last year, fell short a little bit. Uh, what's it been like for you guys? We've still been practicing, but um, one of the main things has been recover your body, right. um, get ready mentally for the game. Being surrounded with such great coaching, uh, what have they done for you? Yeah, I've been at St. Thomas all four years. Right. So Coach Wilson has coached me for two years, and through him, I've learned so much like just his NFL experience everything he's taught me the fundamentals like I could take it to the next level he's helped me a lot just a family atmosphere coach Harry has been like that uh, what's it like to play for coach Harry um coach Harry is a fantastic man um man of God um he constantly preaching to us how we should be it's not about just being a better football player for him it's about um, coaching kids to become better men what's it like being at St. Thomas Aquinas from from a student athlete standpoint as a student athlete, it's about tradition. So uh, we have no choice but to uphold that tradition, and, you know, keep the standard going. You take a look at this program. A win this Saturday could keep you in the running for a national title. From a standpoint of just being a senior, how great would that be? I mean, that'd be great, but at this point, we're just taking it one game. Right. And I feel like we're peaking at the right time. So, so if that happens, then it happens. But we we'll focus on getting the state championship. And, and in talking about peaking at the right time, coming down the stretch, how's that helped you for this week? It's definitely helped us because at this point I feel like we're battle tested. Right. So, you know, we've been through some games, we've been through some fights, come back um, from being under a few times. And I feel like at this point, we know what we could do, we know what we're capable of, and um, I think we're ready. You take a look at this offensive line, you talked about it, for a young quarterback. Uh, what has that been like? I think I've watched your quarterback mature so much over the last couple of months. What's it been like for you? Because you have some pups next to you, and you've got to be that leader. Had you relished that? Yeah, I mean, when I was a junior, I looked up to the older guys myself. So when I became a senior, I was always planning on being the backbone for the offensive line and um, for the offense in general. So especially for our young quarterback and the young guys next to me, um, it's important to be, be that anchor so they know they have somebody to rely on. And through that, we can uh, get um, Zion's confidence up and yeah. then our offense will just keep rolling. Listen, man, you've done a great job. Congratulations on what you guys have achieved. We're looking forward to Saturday evening, 7 o'clock. Usually St. Thomas plays the first games, usually playing the last game of the state championship series. Marlon, congratulations. We'll see you soon. Appreciate that.